Well lads, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be telling you how you can keep FIFA 22 career mode fun. From personal experience, career mode can be very boring and bland after a while of getting into it. Uh, so today's are just some challenges, some just ways to keep it fun in general. So at number one is using a player as a manager. So if you don't know already, you can go into player career mode and select a player who is already playing now like Messi or Ronaldo or whoever you want and you can retire them basically. You won't be able to choose the team you want to play, but they w you will get some options t of teams that are already in the game. I don't know what I meant to say, but you d will get some options. Depending on the player, of course, if you're going to be choosing a player who isn't well known, you might not get as good of teams. But if you choose a player like Messi, you might get a lower end Premier League team. So at number two is a challenge. So through the past few FIFAs, there's a load of wonder kids. And not every single one of them have reached their potential. If you go onto a website like Footways or Footbin, I think Footbin does career mode. Uh, you can just search up Wonder Kids from two, FIFA 16, FIFA 17, FIFA 18, on and on. And use those players because they still do have some potential in the game. They might not have as good as potential as they used to, but you still can use them. At number 3 is using free agents. It is another challenge. Free agents in the game... They are very good, especially when you get into the later seasons. You can find 94 ratings, 95, 90, any rating really. But if you start off at a lower league team like uh, Lane, Lane, I can't say Lane Orient, I can't say that name, and sign players like uh, Mitchell Duke, he's a very good free agent in FIFA 22 uh, for a lower league striker. Just use free agents, or if you're even going for Barcelona, who aren't having the best time with financial money financial money financial in general you can sign free agents or uh really well in fairness just sign free agents it's a good challenge to go this kind of opposite of the last uh challenge if you want to take over a team like newcastle who have got a new takeover you can add a billion i think it is to that team and you can sign whoever you want really and just have a real fun career mode by signing people that you really like in the game to use and just making that team the best team in Europe or whatever continent that team is playing. And finally is another challenge you can use a team like Wrexham. If you don't know already Wrexham are a non-league team currently in the English 5th division I think it is and they are in the rest of the world category in FIFA. If you want to take them to the best team in FIFA uh, or the Premier League or the Champions League or whatever league you want to put them in uh, I suggest putting them into League 2, but you can put them in whatever league you can. Or choose any team in general who are a lower league team in whatever country, whatever nation, that's the same thing. Country and nation are the same thing, I don't know what I'm on about. Um, but just go ahead, just do a, a rebuild basically. Right lads, thank you so much for watching this video. If you do want to support me, you can make sure you do subscribe and like the video. If you do want to join my community Discord, the link will be down below. And if you do want to follow my TikTok as well. Uh, it'll be linked down below and thank you for all the support while I've been just disappeared really uh, I wanted to upload but I couldn't and it's been four months so I just want to say thank you for 800 700 and 600 I think it was actually I think it was 500 as well subscribers uh, it's been mental right I'll talk to you in the next video